Hello, everybody. KP68 here again. Uh, just a little station update. We've got a new toy here. Um, I've been on the fence about this for quite a while, and uh, I don't know. I finally just, uh, decided to jump in and do it. Um, this is a SDR, software-defined uh, receiver. And it's uh, RSP2, Radio Spectrum Processor 2, by uh, SDR Play. Um, this is just a real, real brief video. I don't have much time today. Uh, this is by, by no means a instructional video. It's just me uh, screwing around with this and uh, finding stuff out on my own. But uh, right, right now it's on mute. And uh, let's see here. I'll just go down. i uh, show you what I uh, found out. Whatever. All right. This is the, your, uh, you got your modes right here. Uh, AM, synchronous AM, uh, CW. Broadcast FM, narrow FM, lower side band, upper side band. And then, uh, interestingly enough, uh, when I got this, AM wasn't in this box. So you got to go here, dots, and then this will appear. Whatever you check right here will appear in this box. So I had to come in here, check AM, hit OK, and then boom, there it was. All right, coming down here, here's your IF filter. Uh, I hear about people uh, sending their radios out to get the, uh, the hi fi receive mod. All oh, right here, all it is, a click of the mouse. Uh, I can go as narrow as I want or as wide as I want, depending on who I'm listening to. Uh, normally, CB radios, some you know, buddies are talking, leave it on 3.5, 3, maybe 4. But then uh, it sounds really nice for you, some of the guys with Dave-made transmitters out there, like a 225 or a 131 or... Uh, uh, Mother Moth will be out there talking on on his on his station, so I'll open that up and it, it oh God it sounds fantastic. I caught some of them guys on Gates. Um, I'll, I'll play that in a minute. But uh, coming down here, then you have your other options: your AGC, uh, noise blanker, noise reduction, squelch, uh, notch filter. That's another really nice feature. I'm not going to get into that. And then uh, up here, then you have your frequency selection. You can either, you can scroll through, uh, change these. Anything you want, I'll show you that in a minute. But uh, or there's a way you can just manually punch in the frequency you want. And then here's your volume. Right now it's on mute. Man, there's nobody on. I've, I've been I've been postponing this video until the skip's been rolling, but there hasn't been anything rolling. <laughs> I'm gonna center this real quick. Boop. All right. So up here, start and stop. I'm not gonna get on to this. But uh, back in the RSP2 box, uh, there's two two jacks. You have your SMA. S M A A and B. Right now I'm plugging in A, so I have that uh, checked. Now these are your two main receive settings, uh, or RF gain. Now you have an IF gain setting. These absolutely have to be set right because you can easily overload uh, the receiver um, uh, depending on the band conditions, what band I'm listening to, how crowded it is. There's a lot of factors to go in uh, to setting these uh, right. So if you don't have these set right, it <laughs> yeah, I'll get to it. I'll turn around quick. Sound, sound, sound pretty bad. But anyhow, uh, just for your... I'm not going to get into this visual gain. This has to do with the display. And then... Uh, all right. So coming over here, let's see. In the re, uh, re, uh, record. This is one I really like about this. Uh, boy, like I said, this sucks. There's nobody on. I can record now. Um, come over here into this uh, screen. Hit record. As soon as I hit record or start here, it's going to start recording. All right. I'm not going to record right now. But uh, again, uh, I can set these filters. It'll record whatever whatever settings you have here. It's going to record it. So um, I can even start this up. I can go back to the home section here, and I'm going to unmute this. Unfortunately, like I said, nobody's damn nobody's on right now. So there's a whole lot of static <laughs> uh, right here. Uh, this is my uh, the, the receive bandwidth. Right now it's uh, on one megahertz. Don't quote me on this, but this is what. Uh, uh, I'm going to that. Uh, what the computer's processing at every any given one point. So right now I have it on one megahertz, and I can see the entire CB band right now. Right now it's around channel one, up past channel forty. And anybody and anything that emits RF, uh, was gonna, you're going to see a spike pop up. All right, let me uh, go back to here. Man. And whatever I have this, uh, you can see my mouse wherever I click on. See, I'm off right there. I just hit the mouse wheel and bring it up to the five. Bummer. Nobody on. Okay. So you can either click or point and click whatever channel you want. See this. Scroll the wheel. Bring it up to the five. Somewhere there. Channel 19. Or nope. Oops. Pardon me. Not 19. Alright. Nobody's not going to mute that. 
So over here, you have your this just how it's displayed. Normally, I'll have this depending on the noise level, whatever band I'm listening to. I like, me personally, I like to have it right about there. And then uh, these are hot. Like I said, boy, this is tough. Nobody's on. This controls uh, how high the, well, as you can see, how high the uh, spikes go. Bring that down a little bit. And then uh, we can see the center of the screen's right here. I can come over here, hit the center. I'll center that to the center of the screen. <laughs> I'm not even making any sense. So, um, normally I have the center on channel 20. I can come up here, scroll the wheel. Uh, bring it up to the 5. And I'm going to hit center. That's just the way I like it. Of course, zoom. zoom. You can zoom in on zoom and all that. Um, like I said, this is just me screwing around. All right, nobody on. Sometimes I'll sit here and just scroll the dial. What's going on here? Ah, oh, you get the drift there. Let's go through and come down to the commercial AM band. William. Oh, it's, yeah. Here's your IF filters right here. Too narrow takes away fidelity. Too much, you get a lot of skirt hiss. So basically, I'll just set these whatever sounds most pleasant to the ear. General Motors, thousands and thousands of employees are going to be laid off. Up to 14,000 jobs in North America gone. Oh, boy. Uh, the Terrible mix news. Of those who work in factories, those who are... All right, let's get out of here. It's too depressing. Let's go up to a uh, commercial FM band. Let's get a 102.5. Give me a second here. Uh, yeah. Let's go to the FM. DVE. South Park Mitsubishi dot com. South Park Mitsubishi. Feel the difference. All right. Here's a band that comes in handy here. One of the area's top accounting programs. Mostly all the commercial Park's bands. So let's go up here. Education program matches. Hit 10 megahertz wide. This will take a while to recover here. Full time work while earning college credits. Yeah, I'll start zooming again. Pointpark.edu slash accounting. All right, I can zoom out. More. One in seven families struggles to and get And there we go. There's a lot of the eat. FM stations right neighbors, there. Your <laughs> and again, you have your uh, IF filters here. You can go as narrow as you want or as wide as you want. Unmute that. Center this. And zoom in. I want to. Amen, brother. <laughs> Do some more snooping around here. What's this? It is from the imprisonment from which Paul wrote Second Timothy that he was executed. Uh oh. Uh, there was dried fruit. <laughs> all right. So, all right. Enough of that. So, uh, let's see, I'm gonna make a hit record right now. Like I said, here's record function. Come here, hit record, and then if I hit start on that, it's gonna record. So, uh, I'm gonna stop that and show you some of the recordings I already have. Uh let's uh, go back to here. Home. I'm gonna hit stop. And, uh, oh, by the way, yeah, when I, after I'm done recording, after I hit stop recording, it's, it pops into my music, um, uh, music files. So, let's see here. Last time Skip was rolling, I got the 225 in there. That was 722. Uh, let's hear him. Good job to do. If he wants to get a name called, he can come over here and spike the mic on his transmitter there, break. We are making all kinds of noise in my week. 73 show all right, then I got a spark plug in there. I think that was the same day. Uh, good afternoon, 612. Spark plug, small, small, waving right back. And I think I had that filter around 5, uh, 5 kilohertz wide. And that's a 612, Roger. Bye, 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 bye. 
<laughs> All right. And then I got uh, 131 in here. Where are you hiding 131? Damn, you're tricky. All right, there he is. Going on down here. Now, we all been jonesing for a little bit of DX, man. We all been joning, Joe's jonesing out here for just a little bit of DX, man. It's been so quiet. It's been so quiet. We a little bit of a north south, little little bit of north south at night, but that's about it, man. Ain't been no DX out here. I don't even turn on this radio. Shoot, I don't even know when, man. I come over here, you, you know, you like say you blow the cobweb. I literally was blowing the cobwebs and the dust off this radio. <laughs> okay, there's him, <laughs> and then uh, I even recorded some commercial AM. Just to compare it to, I don't know, some of the other wide band uh, CB transmitters. Commercial talk, even two. In the mid 90s, but heat index values up to 108 degrees. Okay, what a job to do. If he wants to get a name called, he can come over here and spike the mic on it. In the mid 90s, but. He so, anyhow, there's that. <laughs> this is just a brief run. Like I said, I just. I did this off the cuff here, uh, no planning. It was just me babbling, and then, uh, like I said, I am a no way, no pro, uh, no pro with this. Um, this is me finding out stuff on my own, and there's a lot uh, other cool things this can do. Oh yeah, one more thing. Uh, let me go back up to uh, here. Let's start this here. Oh yeah, yeah. There we go. Yeah, AM. Another really cool thing about this uh, all right uh you can have uh, two different uh multiple receivers at the same time uh, let me go narrow it back up to one megahertz all right here hold on get this back a little noise center of this oh what am i doing here All right, there we go. So my noise level just played on. Hopefully I like it. All right, let's say uh, I meet that. Uh, one cool thing about this, uh, let's say I'm talking to my good buddy, uh, Wild Dog 327 up here. And he says, hey, KP, uh, I'll be back in a little bit. i got to go strangle some hookers. I'll be like, okay, you can have fun with that. Uh, let me know how that works out. So I'm going to be dying to hear how his escapade goes. But get, uh, somebody told me up on 36 Lower Side Band, they're telling uh, your mother so ugly jokes. Man, if I could only listen to both of them at the same time. Ah, I can. So I'm going to go in here. I'm going to go to receive. I'm going to hit my receiver pane. I'm going to hit right here. Add another receiver. All right. And okay, that's selected. I'll go to uh, 36. Lower and put that in the sideband. All right. Unmute this. And I can, these are completely independent of, on volume and a mode. So on channel 20, just so I can barely hear him as he jumps back in there, bring channel 20 volume down. And I can move this select. You want to know what it's about? Yeah, let me know what it's about. So now I can barely hear channel 20 if he jumps back in there. And I can hear these guys up on uh, lower, th lower 36. Pretty cool. Pretty neat. Right, I'm going to stop that. Close. And then they kill that. And then right back to where I was. So, <laughs> neat stuff. Really, really neat. I think I'm going to stop that. So, anyhow, that's it in a nutshell. Oh, one more thing. I got my REA. Uh, uh, program open. Um, right now, I have everything turned off. My drivers are all turned off, so uh, I have the uh, when I key up, it's not going to activate the REA. But I have the REA open, so when during uh, if I want to transmit, there's the REA that pops up. I can more mod modulation, and then when I unkey, it's going to switch back right to the uh, SDR. Pretty cool. Uh, anyhow, I uh, I can't imagine going back to just looking at a S meter on the radio. Um, <laughs> maybe another video I'll show you how how I have everything all hooked up. Um, I have the uh, I use the uh, MFJ seventeen oh eight uh, automatic switch box, but that's that. That'll be another video. I'll do a little update video and show you how on my Mickey Mouse how everything hooked up there. <laughs> all right, guys. Hope uh, man, I really babbled on this one. I hope it made some kind of sense. I'm going to watch this and once again go, oh my God, why, don't I, why, why did I upload that? But I hope everybody's doing good out there. KP68, I'm here in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. I'm out.